some of you might know, um, well, at the time I am recording this, it is January 11th, 2023, um, but I just wanted to take a look back at 2022, the best year ever of my life. 2022 was the best year of my life for so many different reasons. We start in January. Nothing much really happened in January. Um, you have February. We had um, a second straight year of some snow. And I mean, I live in North Richmond Hills, Texas, which is near DFW. Doesn't snow at much often at all. It snows like maybe once every three years. So I got some snow right there. It's about 1.7 inches of snow. So yeah, I liked like that. Um, and then um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Ruby. <laughs> Ruby in the snow. Um, and then, um, that was in February. Um, I went to the Fort Worth Zoo a couple times right there. There's a giraffe. Um, it's just a little mini moment. Um, Um, I also went to, um, the Dallas Perot Museum, I guess, a couple pictures right here. Pictures right here. Um, I went to this, like, little, like, um, Hope Kids event, um, it was like a little thing, um, what was the date was that, on March 25th, um, so yeah, I went to that little event, um, yeah, um, 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 and then this was also the second ever Maver game that I had, I had ever been to, right here, I actually made a YouTube short on that, on, March 27th, um, let me go channel, go playlist, and go right here, that should be news, Maverick game right here. JB buttface, screw you dude, um, but yeah, I went to a mapper game, it was the second ever mapper game I had been to, um, overall April was, um, fine, I just, if you watch them, some of my, um, some of my older shorts from, um, from about late March, early April, you'll see that, um, sometimes I, I had a band wrapped around, like, um, my, um, face, and, um, that's because my eye got so swollen. I mean, this is what I looked like at one time. You can see the swelling under the eye. So, my eye got really swollen at that time. Um, but, um, I also went to another Maverick game. Um, right about here. Went to another Maverick game, April 10th. Um, and then there was, um, there was Easter 2022, um, I went to NRH 2 Family Water Park a couple different times. Whenever I go there in the summer, I will make shorts on that, but I mean, it's, it's only January right now. They don't open until a little bit late May, um, I've never actually, um, said this, but, um, this is my favorite, um, band, like, like, singer band, 21 Pilots, so, uh, in, in May, um, I, I went to the Northeast Mall to see the cinema experience, um, to see that, um, 
first of May wasn't much. Um, and you have the last day of May. First Ranger game I went to that season. I've been to many Ranger games before that. This was my first of this season, the 2022 season. So yeah, that was that. Um, um, I went to the Fort Worth Zoo again. There's some meerkats. Um, there's a hippo. <laughs> and I went to NRH2O again. There's my favorite ride right there, the Viper. Um, June 2022 is also when I discovered my love for bowling. I made a couple shorts about bowling. I go bowling at least like two times a week. I only make, sh I only really make shorts about of it uh, about once a month. But um, yeah, during um the summer um there was this thing. It was kids bowl for free um or anybody under the age of like seventeen um. I mean I'm thirteen so um yeah there was um well kids bowl for free every day um so yeah I did that. Plenty of times, and um, I at first I got a score of about like like forty to fifty. Now my average is about a hundred. I mean, my highest score now is one seventy three. So yeah. Um, I also went mini golfing at Alley Cats, where I go, where I went bowling uh, pretty much every day during the summer. And then we have the second best moment of 2022. Um, because I had cancer twice, um, I I went to Medical City Children's Hospital in Dallas, Texas, and um, each summer for about six days, they have a summer camp called Camp I Hope. You can search it up on YouTube or Google it. It will show Camp I Hope in Anna, Texas. So I finally was able to go back there in 2022 for the first time in real life since 2019. I went there in real life in 2019, 2020, and 2021. I, it was through Zoom, but this year I was finally able to go back there in person. Here's some cool fireworks that I saw. Um, there was a lot more, but um, I was, um, I might see if I can um like get a couple shorts out there um this year. I don't know if I can, but um I will see if I can. And that was June, and now we're entering July. Y'all all know what I did in July. The the best week ever of my life. June 2nd, no, July 2nd through July 9th of 2021, I went to Walt Disney World. The best week ever of my life. Here's some pictures I got on the plane. Um, and then since I went, since I went to Disney World through Make-A-Wish, I, um, I stayed at a resort called Give Kids the World Village. Um, it's absolutely amazing whenever or um, if I go back I um, might go sometime during spring break or in the summer I will make a short there um, and then July 2nd we went to Hollywood Studios no July 3rd we went to Hollywood Studios my favorite park in Disney it also had my favorite ride the Hollywood Tower of Terror <laughs> And then on um, July 4th, Independence Day, I went to Animal Kingdom for about half or for about half a day. Um, that's a big Animal Kingdom tree right there. So yeah, I went to Animal Kingdom there. Um, that that park was home to my third favorite ride, the Avatar Flight of Passage ride. I'm upset that I didn't. Uh, it, I mean. My, my shorts are very successful. I mean, one of them home to one of my most popular shorts, Universal Studios. I will explain that in a second, but um, at Hollywood Studios, I made two shorts. I wish I would have gotten one about the Star Wars rides, Rise of Resistance, and Smuggler's Run. Those probably would have got a poop ton of views. But um, I got what I got. Um, you know, Animal Kingdom, I wish I would have included Avatar Flight of Passage, but it's fine. That was my third favorite ride there. 
and then we went back to Hollywood Studios to ride um, a, a ride that we didn't get to ride, and then um, we spent the last hour at Magic Kingdom Park. Magic Kingdom was absolutely amazing that day. And, oh god, hold on. Um, um, oh god, frick. Um, I'm gonna have to go quick. Um, July 5th, we went to Universal Studios. That might have been my favorite park there. Um, yeah, Universal Studios and Island of Adventure. Some of my favorite rides were the Incredible Hulk roller coaster, the Velocicoaster roller coaster. Minion Mania. Um, and then July 6th, we stayed at our village just to have a little rest day and actually check out the village because it's a really neat place. Um, so, yeah. And then July 7th, we went to Epcot and Magic Kingdom. Epcot, that day was, it was, <laughs> that half of the day, it was extremely hot and humid. We were sweating down our whole shoulders. Um, and then, um, the other half of the day, it, j about 6 through 11, it was rainy and humid, but I got that picture of the castle. Um, there's this amazing picture right here that I, well, that, no, I, I didn't get, but that's an amazing picture of the fireworks show. Go check that short out that I did. And now what might have been my favorite park was Sea World Orlando. We checked out the dolphin show, um, and we rode the Mako, the Manta, the Icebreaker, three great roller coasters. We also checked out the, um, the Killer Whale show, also as well as a fireworks show. I got this fantastic picture, and who is it? Okay, 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 I'm still good. I have, usually have an alarm set for 8.30, and it's 8.30 right now, but it's not going off, okay, so... I can still hear me, um, yeah, see, so yeah, I was gonna get some of the fireworks show on one of the short, but I ran out of time, and then July 9th, I went to the Kennedy Space Center, that was also great, um, and then, yeah, and then July 10th, we flew back to Texas, um, and then literally the day after July 11th, we went to another Ranger game, um, and then, um, for a couple days, I hanged out with my grandparents, um, a couple cousins, and um, one day we went to Sea Life, not Sea World, Sea Life Aquarium in the um, in a Grapevine Mills Mall, I think. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and then shortly after this is when I discovered my love for my favorite theme park ever. That y'all all know exactly what it is. Literally. My background cover is Mr. Freeze, the best ride I've ever rode at Six Flags over Texas. Y'all know exactly what that is. I've made 80 freaking million shorts there. So yeah, um, first day I went there, August 3rd, it was my love for Six Flags was discovered. So yeah, and then um, July or August 6th, we went to another Ranger game. This one was probably the best one we went to because look at our seats. We got our seats through Make a Wish, so that's why. Um, then I went back to, I don't even need to explain me going to Six Flags because I go there every weekend. Or at least two times every weekend. Um, August 13th, we went to another Ranger game. That one was very special. That was Ian Kinsler got nominated into the Rangers Hall of Fame. So, yeah. Um, I went bowling again, went to Six Flags, I went um, to another Ranger game, August 26th, um, um, and then, in one of the best moments, on September 13th, as I explained, I love 21 Pilots, which is, I have a poster right there and right there, I love 21 Pilots, September 13th was my second ever concert for them to go to, but the, this one was like my first like real real concert. I went to a concert back in October of 2021. That wasn't that one was in Austin, um, and it was like um, right. I'll show you a picture of that. Um, that concert was in Austin. Um, we were um, we were standing way far away from them. We were standing here, and Lily, Josh, and Tyler 
are way over there. We were sitting very far away. Um, it took like four hours to drive over there. Um, but and then this one in September was a lot. I mean, a, one in October 2021 was still great, but this one was even better because it was an actual like real concert. So I love 21 Pilots. I may or may not have heard my second favorite song, "Ode to Sleep." <laughs> my favorite song, "My Blood." My favorite song by 21 Pilots is "My Blood" on Trench. Go go check it out. My favorite album by them is Scaled and Icy. Go check it out. Made in May 2021. I'm trying to go fast because this video has been kind of long. Um, September 14th, I went to another Ranger game. Um, um, and then and then this was the start of... Um, yeah, this was the start of Six Flags Flight Fest. Um, I made a couple shorts there. Um, I, this day I went to like a little park um, or something like that. Um, and then October 4th, the last Ranger game I went to, we beat the Yankees. Um, yeah. And then um, October 7th, I went to a Mavericks preseason game. Um, actually, no, I forgot about this. September 29th, I went to a Dallas Stars preseason game. Um, um, and then, yeah, pretty quiet the next two months. Um, October 12th, I went to Urban Air. I made a short about that. Go check that out. Um, I really gotta go to the bathroom, but, um, and then there was, um, there was Halloween, I also went, final day of Fright Fest, I got some amazing pictures of the oil derrick, this was also the weird day when Texas Skyscreamer got stuck 40 feet in the air, there was a power outage in DFW, and some things got, like, shut down, so, that's why it was stuck like that, they eventually got them down, but they were stuck 400 feet in the air, for about 20 minutes on Halloween night, Mr. Freeze got shut down too. I was in line for Mr. Freeze. Um, and then November 4th, I went to a real, like, regular season Maverick game. I made a short about that. Go check that out. Um, and then the next couple of weeks was pretty quiet. Um, there was Thanksgiving. Um, awesome. Um, uh, and then now we're entering Holiday in the Park of Six Flags. Um, I also, um, I, I went to this cool little, um, thing, it, what was it, like, I don't remember what it's called, but I made a short about it, um, and then we have Christmas, um, one of the best Christmases of my life, and that's kind of about the end, this video is very long, about, uh, right now, it's just under 18 minutes, um, I, this is so, I, I feel like this is a little bit more of a more entertaining video than the others. Um, last, last video I made that wasn't NFL picks um, was like two months ago. And yeah, I know I did not make NFL Week 18 picks. I, I, I kind of forgot about them a little bit and it was way too late. So um, I will, ex or I will tell you my, or I will tell you what I did in Week 17 and Week 18 in my wild card, um, in, in my wild card video pitch room picks which will come out tomorrow at about 8 p.m. um 8 p.m. central time so yeah that's gonna pretty much be the um the end of this video a year of 2022 um 2022 year in review um best year of my life um I also made some new um some new friends, some new friends on the Sam Plays New Gun Twins channel, much love from me, um, but yeah, um, that's gonna be the end of this video, I feel like there's something that I'm forgetting, um, but I don't know, if, I don't necessarily know if there's anything too inter um, important, oh, um, I also forgot, back in February, um, I went on a, on a very fun school field trip to Sky Ranch, in um in north texas um it's basically like um a science camp um, for kids to stay at um for a couple of days so yeah um it's very fun um so yeah that's gonna be the end of this video for real now um thank you all for an amazing 2022 2023 is gonna be great too not as good as 2022 um uh, but um this week of my life in july um june was great um 
thank you all for an amazing year, and I will see you tomorrow. Um, goodbye, go Rangers, F you Astros, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye. This is 20-Minute Weird. Peace.